So hello folks welcome back to our session. So in this particular session we'll be focusing on tweets related to Donald Trump and see what is the general public opinion or what is the general public sentiment regarding him. So let's start by fetching some relevant tweets about him with Tweepy. For those who don't know what a Tweepy is let me tell you Tweepy is an open source wrapper written in Python and this will help you to communicate with Twitter platform and use its API. In our case we'll be using it to read and write the tweets. But before using Tweepy in order to authenticate yourself you need to sign in to dev.twitter.com and create an app over there. Let me show you how our Twitter app looks like. So this sample Twitter app which I have created as sentiment underscore analysis underscore edureka. Well it's a very simple process just click on create app and it will just guide you through a series of steps. Just enter the details and your app is ready. All right. Well the main thing to focus over here is this key and token access. Okay, for this particular video, I'll be just changing my consumer key and the secret key. Let's regenerate consumer key and secret key. Okay, it's done. And my access token key and my access token secret. Let me regenerate them too. So you need mainly four variables in order to prove your authentication. The consumer key, which is our API key, the consumer secret, which is an API secret, the access token, and the access token secret. All right, fine. So let's start by importing Tweepy. Import Tweepy. Next, as I said, I'll be using text blob. So let's import it too. So your Tweepy is done, your text blob is done. So the very first thing that I need to do is authenticate myself with those four keys I just discussed. All right. So let's define them a consumer key, consumer secret, access token, and access token secret. Now let me just copy paste them for you. This is my consumer key, my consumer secret. Next, my access tokens. These are my access token. All right. And the access token secret. Fine. There is something. Just make sure that you copy and paste it right. If you don't, you won't be able to authenticate yourself over Twitter. All right. You need to establish a connection between Python and Twitter. Fine. So, what do you want to search? Well, like, I want to search for Donald Trump. Donald Trump. So what I want I'm telling Tweepy show me some tweets regarding Donald Trump. Let's see what it gives. All right, the result is out here. So as you can see here, these are various live tweets which we have just fetched from the Twitter. As a result, you can see here we have a sentiment report which consists of the polarity as well as the subjectivity. Well, the sentiment score will depend on how clean your data is. More cleaner the data, more accurate will be your sentiment score. So this was all for this session. Stay tuned for my next video where I'll tell you how you can improve your sentiment score. All right. So thank you folks. In case you have any doubt, don't hesitate to add your query over the comment section. Thank you.